We're now in the kitchen for our recipe of the day. We'll be making, ready for this, Polynesian grilled chicken breast with fresh pineapple mm. cilantro relish over brown pecan rice. I, I lost my you head. You had me. Sounds I had <laughs> Okay, so don't be fooled by the long name. This is really easy to make. Ann Lemke with the Art of Entertaining is here to show us how it's done. Good morning, Ann. Good morning. Thank you for being on the show this morning. Thanks for so having me. Show us how to do this easy. Okay, yes, it's very easy. And okay. actually, when Dana asked me to come, she said, hey, will you do something light for the for the new year? Which you totally get, right? We're all on diets. So here we <laughs> yes. go. So we're starting out with some grilled chicken, okay. and we're going to marinate it. And Dana's going to do that for me. And just put a little bit of that Oh, on. Okay, not, not the, the whole thing. thing. What yeah. is this? This is called Montreal steak seasoning. I, it's steak seasoning, right? But I love it. Ooh, and I put it chicken. on all kinds of things. Okay. So that's perfect. Okay. And then if you want to go ahead and pour some of that, that's pineapple juice. Really? And it's just unsweetened pineapple juice. You just want to use something that's light and nice, and we don't want to put a lot of oil or anything on it because we're making a light dish, right? I can and, do this all. And how long do you marinate it for? <laughs> well, I like to marinate it for a couple hours if possible. Okay. But you know, everything's fine. You know, like let's say you're in a hurry and you don't have that much time, then just do like, you know, a half hour, an do hour. Do what you can. Do yeah. what you can, okay. right? We're all brushing around these days and got all a lot right. to do. So you got the meat. So great, and so I did already grill the chicken too, just so that you guys it would make it go a little quicker too, and we have the time constraints here. So actually, the first thing I'm gonna do then over here is add in all of these ingredients to make the relish that's gonna go on top of the chicken. Okay, so and, pineapples? Yep, that's pineapple. There. Do you wanna help Does, or? Is it in, in order? <laughs> do or it, you, Anthony. you can just throw it all yeah. in there. Little onions, that's yep. red onion, right? Red onion. Sweeter, right? Yes, please. Is that cilantro? Yes. Cilantro. Okay. And, and a little tomatoes. red pepper. Oh, red oh, peppers. Peppers, got it. Okay. Give it a little color and give it a little That's spice. That's the relish. Too. Yeah. The cheese is feta cheese. Um, we're going to save that for okay. the top. All right. And then this, this is my favorite utensil in the whole kitchen. I have it. It's mm -hmm. all, you have one. <laughs> yeah, I was going to say, if you don't have one, go get one because it's Especially awesome. For limes. Right? Yeah, those are hard to squeeze And up. you get so much more juice out of it, too. So I'm going to put the whole lime in there, too, because that's going to give it tons of flavor. And again, it's going to, you know, be light and nice and delicious. So all you do is layer, put that on top of Pretty much the so, pretty next. much so. So actually, I'm just going to give this a little stir just to let it sit. And again, if you can make this ahead of time, if you can, wanna, you know, like I said, Give it, you know, 30 minutes to sit together because when they marry together, it gets even better, right? The thing that I find fascinating with all the recipes we had on last week and even today, mm -hmm. no salt. No salt. Well, I always let people finish it with salt yeah. if they like to. And I did bring, you know, a salt grinder mm -hmm. and, a, and a pepper grinder just because but that's everybody likes a little one. First in the, you know, right. already right. in, you can kind of add to taste. Yeah. Now I we're like going to post too. this entire recipe because I know we didn't quite finish here, but we're going to post the entire recipe on our Facebook page shortly after the show. And you can always stop by Art of Entertaining if you'd like them to do the cooking for you. Every Monday, they have a family night special. You can learn more about the Art of Entertaining in Webster Groves on your screen. Thank you so much for being here Thank with us. Thank you.